c'est dans l'un que nous nous sommes retrouvés avec mes camarades, sur un plan d'eau d'un peu plus d'une cinquantaine d'hectares. Par discrétion, pour les pêcheurs locaux, je tairai volontairement le nom du plan d'eau, qui est un plan d'eau public. Il s'agit d'une eau technique, où s'alternent plateau et cuvette, et où les poissons sont méfiants, car ils sont soumis à une forte pression de pêche tout au long de l'année. Mon objectif dans ce DVD est de mettre en avant l'importance des montages, de l'amorçage et des appâts que l'on déploie habituellement sur des eaux surpêchées. Débutons avec Rob, qui nous vient d'Angleterre et qui est bed designer. You are a bed designer. How did you start this, to doing this? Um, it's a long story really. It goes back uh, a few years and uh, I was looking for a way to catch more fish. Mm -hmm. um, when you have the rig right and you have uh, the position right and you're on a good lake and you're quiet and everything is good what is left to uh, to help catch more fish and the simple answer was to make bait better yeah baits of course well you bring some baits with you mm -hmm. uh, i brought a bait that's it's really quite a soft bait mm -hmm. it breaks down very very quickly in the water okay Uh, we know, of course, there are poisson chat and crayfish, but on the hook we will uh, use, use a, another bait. Use a harder a hook bait that is harder. Okay. Mm. Can you speak about uh, the boiling? Peace boiling. Yeah, absolutely. But uh, a very nutritionally balanced bait. Okay. So, not only is it uh, a long-term bait that the fish will keep feeding on for season after season after season but they will probably feed more season after season the more it's introduced mm -hmm. the more they will feed on it okay uh, the uh, the nutrition is um, coupled with attraction so we have not just a very nutritious bait but a very attractive bait at the same time all based around uh, natural uh, extracts and uh, ingredients so It's a boilie with fish meal, for of, sure? Of course. <laughs> Two, three different types of fish meal. Mm -hmm. um, Why do you use fish meal? Uh, because fish meal is one of the, the, the greatest uh, sources of digestible protein for a fish. Mm, It's also course. a fantastic attractor for a fish. They love yes. to eat fish meal mm. of different, different types. They, uh, the standard fish meal provides Um, the, the nutritional uh, aspect, also a lot of taste for the bait, not flavor but taste. Mm. And then the pre-digested fish meals that are completely water soluble uh, provide a lot of attraction. As, they, as the bait breaks down they disperse into the water and bring fish to the area. Yeah. So I understand um, that you use uh, harder boilies for uh, the hair. Mm -hmm. um, And uh, so soft bait for um, baiting. Mm -hmm. How fast uh, does it break down this boiler? Well, quite simply, this bait will be completely broken down within uh, within 48 hours. It's gone. On a lake like this, with a, a big population of crayfish and poisson chat, a bait like this will last less than 24 hours. Mm -hmm. uh, but there's a reason I like to have. Uh, a soft bait that breaks down very quickly. It means it can be digested very easily by the car and uh, the breakdown speed uh, correlates to the uh, to the attraction. As the bait breaks down it releases all the attractants into the water very very quickly uh, and doesn't hold them inside. If you use a very hard bait there is no way yes. for the attractant to leak. Yeah, of course. We speak Rob about balance boiling but What is balanced boiling to you? Well, a balanced boil is, is basically when you uh, have the correct quantities of uh, protein, carbohydrates and lipid uh, and when that's coupled with the correct natural attractors. And then we have a balanced bait that is balanced for the carp's diet. Mm. And naturally they will be attracted to, uh, to something like that because It's pre-programmed when they are born to be attracted to a good diet. Yeah, and um, we speak a lot uh, how you you know 
in magazine about uh, uh, protein, lipid, mineral, vitamin, of course, and amino acid. What about amino acid? All know? animals need uh, a certain quantity of amino acids to survive uh, and be healthy. So by balancing the amino acid profile of a bait, uh, it means that the carp is getting everything it needs and it doesn't need to go off to look for crayfish or mussels or bloodworm. It means it gets everything it needs just from picking mm. up a bait. And yeah. the beauty of that is that it makes the bait very attractive very quickly. Après cet échange avec Rob sur les appâts, je vous propose d'aller à la rencontre d'Adrien qui va nous présenter le montage qu'il a utilisé durant cette session. Avant ça, je vous propose de découvrir un joli poisson que j'ai capturé dans la matinée, malgré la très forte chute de température où nous avons perdu plus de 10 degrés en l'espace de 24 heures. Un joli poisson capturé sur un bonhomme de neige signé Bet Lab. Les produits donc que j'utilise depuis maintenant un an et Crob lui utilise depuis plus de 10 ans. Voilà. Malgré les conditions difficiles, eh bien le, la pêche en spot a, a porté ses fruits avec un joli poisson de 19,5 kg. On peut être heureux de cette capture compte tenu des conditions difficiles. Très peu de poissons capturés. C'est vrai que ça fait toujours plaisir de prendre des aussi jolis poissons. Elle a fait un combat époustouflant. Les poissons ici sont extrêmement vifs compte tenu de la profondeur d'eau. Plus de 4 mètres en moyenne. Du coup, les combats sont, sont très forts, très puissants, tout en puissance, tout en vitesse. Ça rend vraiment l'endroit euh, exceptionnel. 